Hey guys, I know you can't see the camera. Just kidding. We can actually see the camera. Yeah, no, I know I did not take much. And our family is coming back. Disconnect the computer. Hello, my Wi-Fi. Its name is Carter in the Simpsons. And I've been working on this for a while. Go to if you're wondering what camera you to make. I'm gonna break into this video or most of my videos that I take off for a walk or using the computer. Why is it on the computer? I use this camera. I've used it then ever since I was like like twenty seven or so. And you turned off. It's a junior skit, so for beginners. As you can see, you can also see myself, right? If you can't, you can't see myself. Well, actually, yes, you can. See that? And also, to make it and see, to make it, you have to use this USB and it plugs in to this slice of computer. You can't see it, but you know, it plugs into that nanny thread that you see on your Windows computer. Um, yeah, you put it in there and then. I'm just saying Windows because I have a Windows computer. Anyways, you can see that we definitely work a long way since then. And yeah, and I basically got my own way of seeing. That. Then you put it on the computer. Then it should load and you take it out and you should have your video for the rest of your life. So basically, that's, I also use the webcam. It's so, I also use the webcam. It's so, like, destroyed now, like, by me. Literally has wires. Not a bit. <laughs> Just kidding. See, yeah, okay, okay, I'm not doing it. Anyways, remember I wanted to review the machine I was making? Hold on, Great one. No, no, this that's just such a mess. I can make books. I'm pretty sure you create a staple and that's part of this. This is one of its pieces. It's done here. This is actually the back of the camera. 2022 style. And you literally just click it like this. And you literally just Lock it on like this, and then you can put the machine. And what's cool about it is that you can also stick more of these pieces, like I showed on my Mono G. You can really see what's working. So far, I got this robot jogging manufacturer, Robot Man. That's what his name is. 2022 Robot Man. 2021 was a little crappy. Now it's 2022, and this is much less crappy. They said much less crappy, and I was like, whatever, and then I was like, fine. It came out in February 2022. A little mini book that can be designed in many ways. And one of them is constructive manufacturing, where you obviously create the robot. I do not know where it is. Anyway, that can't believe it. But, but yeah, I can't believe you can see this room. Sorry, I'm trying to be like Mark Simpson. Anyways, so yeah, that's the end. I'm just kidding. It's not yet. I've been doing that joke. I'm going back to months ago. I always think, I always stay positive. And here's the robot man, how are you doing? I'm doing precise. Like a new 2022 manufacturer. Will there be 2023? I made him like mind voice because I wanted him to be manufactured by me and my friends, my dudes. The other smart dudes out there, you wanna know. But it does, just click in the left screen right below. So yeah, 
Dan 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 Okay, so what it does is on paper. You do like this. That area is more prone. So if you then that area will be more prone when it's actually just kind of I'm gonna use another pen. This pen. And see, it'd be. Maybe a little back. Okay, factory would be in red brick. According to the Council of Christia, warnings are defined. Wad. Wad. Www. Dot. 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 Com. It's a website where you can go to different kinds of stores around the city of Redrick and chat with different people. It's like there's 15 plus. Again, you can chat with other people. You know, go with other people. Hang out with other people online. And they're all from Redbrick. You can even date with artists. Go check the app out now. And my point is, in that they manufacture like the factory and Quinzard City is now grown to be 30 meters high. So I thought that if oh, <laughs> no wonder it looks like a bad drunk in some tape. Hey, the Factory in 1991. They cleaned the factory with rooftops and sleigh bells in January 2001. And they created fire. They created, I don't know why I'm talking about this in the middle of May. They also created blue pad waters, which didn't swim and die. Oh, dude! Then again, my point is. That the factory has grown to be 30 Like, that is about to grow. That way, the factory is across the street. Industries. But I know, it's not smell like industries. It's industry. Industry. And the kid's name for Lot of Guard, which was the one who created samples of meat in 351 BC. They added meat, which was a specialty of royalty, in 211 BC. December 21st and May 18th are the most talking day of my videos. I'm talking about meat. Did you know that meat was the one who invented pork shop in 1921? This is because in that, in that era, people were starving and had thin bodies. And they were wearing soaked up shoes. They were made of meat from chicken, beef, pork, and rats. However, in 1940, they discovered the <laughs> they discovered a way to use poo, believe it or not, <laughs> to make that shoes in five-star royalty. But then, in 1961, they were banned, and they used pork chop shoes, and then it was banned. That was banned in 1992. However, learn. <laughs> that they used normal slippers, which was banned in 2016. So I don't know. Now I'm just using my even bands. That might be banned in 2040. So basically, in 1958, they used 
when my breath was working. <clears throat> they use pork chop and iron. They use royalty around the sky and replace it with new ones. That's right. These new ones were created literally called New Ones brand in 1959. In March 1959, they expanded new ones. And it's still popular in Chrysler City today. Oh, what a nice story. And sometimes they can be pretty well insane, royal, insane, royal, all of the above. But sometimes it can be royal. For example, in 1901, in the Christian War, that was from 1870 to 1931, they created pork chop chicken made out of shirt because they didn't have any. In size 3 to 17, the ages 3 to 17 used chicken, beef, all grilled in, curd in the oven to protect safety from the ages 17 to 21. But for this, they kept on going in certain states, too. This is very rare. Kentucky, California, parts of California, and Michigan, and also Kansas, apparently. And there was once, there was once, the way that they actually invented pork chop. That's right. People back in the day were homeless. And in 1917, then to 1951, they invented pork chog in South. Aww. They actually invented pork chog. What a beautiful story. Sometimes they can be made and manufactured in 3,151 people. Around the globe. By 1971 to 1993, it only got more popular with 7,351 people per pork chop a day, and we're still using it to this day. Today, in 2022, though, over 18,254 people in the city are using the pork chop shoes. But we are still using shop chicken, which was a Chrysler City option in Kansas. However, came to Kansas in 1801, is still eaten to this day, and is created. What a sad story. They can be used, but is very useful. And sometimes, if, say for your birthday, you get, say, a $50 Amazon gift card. Thank your brothers, nieces, aunts, and uncles for the reason you chose. 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 Believe it or not, 6,124 people are eating pork chop chicken and rice and burgers, cheeseburgers, and hamburgers every Minute in Kansas City hamburgers. Oh, that tastes good. They use pea. Or that we need to use pea. Pea was a traditional way for the homeless. The people stranded in deserts. You'd have nothing to drink but 
they're gonna have nothing to eat but me. <laughs> oh jeez, this is so funny. Well, I'm sure. I'm sure about this. From 1730 to 1901, they had these two grams of pea per day. This said four people to leave the region and say that there was no people on the line in 2010. But in 2015, they straightened out for at least one person. On condition, one by one week. There was at least five people in the region. There was only five people in the region. Named Tom, named Tommy, Barrison, Paris, and Sheila. And Brian. So these people wandered around as a family and gave birth to their younger children, increasing the population to to ten. And soon in 1916, it increased to over 20,000 people. How did this? How did this happen? You might ask yourself. Sorry, everything's up to the wall. Well. They continued their lost lives and using over one thousand people killed. But with with no lives left, they still increased in population, tried to move, and eventually twenty thousand people started living there. The town was called Bersegus. But in nineteen forty they decided to change the name to Cliandra Falls. Why? Because Cliandra Falls, they thought, it was an easy, sharp way to think. And since everyone is eating, they couldn't eat their self. They had to eat their starving people. But it is interesting. <laughs> <laughs> now sometimes Bundu can get pretty sanks, which means poor hungry and <laughs> But there's an adventure for us. You can eat pork. So they also added pork top meals. And just then they added chicken meat nuggets. They really. I mean, it's not bad to say that you can't have pork chop, but chopping everything chop. Chopping pork chop, chopping your mouse, chopping your mouse, bad not actually gross. You know, if I move this in the air, my arrow still moves. Click. The video ended, no it didn't. Oh, okay, anyways. When pork chop was invented, they only had a username of cells. Pintle. Pintle in 2001. But they also added in 2004 a new username that can never be questioned and called Mara. So on Instagram, later when Instagram was invented and then you used to do Instagram, they would say, No one liked this. And yet there was like one like, and then like 150,000 likes until it just gets out of hand. Although, I mean, have your, has your phone ever gone to 101 or more percent? 
And if so, you're part of the point zero zero four percent of people who have experienced this at least once in their life. And in fact, fifty people have claimed, and about two hundred people might have actually explained that. Uh, 2022, 20 minutes and 22 seconds, 2025. Anyways, um, whatever. Um, you can actually drink pee. Serious. I'm serious. Pee. Pee. What's an alternative? You know, you know, pee is an alternative, a cup, a cup alternative. Pee contains vitamin A and calcium. However, you could get dietary fiber restrictions and possibly death because of new restrictions. And so, Death can occur if large amounts of properties are consumed per month. It seems as if there's one way or another how many insurance scales of dietary fiber and restrictions in pork meat can in fact improve the studies of arthritis and bone disease. Although so would it surprise you if the pork chop was invented in 1601. That's right. Even though it was said to be invented in 1941, the average still exists in the 1400s and 1500s, but they weren't actually invented in Scotland. The Scottish kind of pork chop, the Western kind of pork chop we know, they back. To at least the 1300s. And this is what sailors from the New Guinea Railway said. But the Scottish did actually P and poop. Anyways, P and poop. They have been added in in you actually been in for over six Hundred years until the millennial area included in 1994, and they included pork chop as one of their dinners. Pork chop in the meat industry was held by chickens pee. Believe it or not, they could have been eating this for hundreds and hundreds and maybe thousands of years. Is this possible? That only time will be possible. That only time will tell. So, I'm disappearing. Three, two, one.